Hey, we are here with Marinda Wu at the uh, Colorado Convention Center in Denver, Colorado. First of all, uh, uh, this organization that you founded, Science is Fun, uh, what's that about? And, and uh, what made you think of the idea and uh, what is it doing? All right, well, I'm happy to be here. And Science is Fun basically got started in the second phase of my career. I actually was an industrial chemist at Dow Chemical for almost 20 years, but when I had the opportunity to go off and do my own thing, I found it science is fun because my daughter came home from school one day when she was um, just finishing up elementary school, going into, I guess you'd call it intermediate school or junior high, and basically she said to me one day after school, Mom, science is so boring. And I thought, oh, how sad. And basically, it's because the elementary school teachers and teachers, just a lot of them, don't have the science background, don't really teach much of what is real science. And I don't fault them. They just haven't had the training, or the tools, or the background to make science fun or relevant for the kids. So what I started was an organization to bring science hands-on activities to get little kids, uh, these are elementary school age, uh, interested in science, finding it a fun thing, not really to convert them all into little budding scientists, but more for them to uh, be interested in science. And I taught all kinds of things. In fact, at one time I had five people working for Science is Fun, giving um, after school enrichment hands-on classes, um, summer camps through the summer, uh, a lot of activity, very popular with all the uh, kids and mothers and local communities because I was filling a void. Uh, kids and parents didn't really have much background with science. And uh, it's, it's actually evolved into other things over the years uh, where it's part of the passions that I have in improving science literacy. And I've worked in many areas with public outreach I recommend that you go to my website, www.marindawu.com, to get more details on many of the different activities I've had over the years in public outreach. But Science is Fun is only one of them. Great. What unique things do you bring to the table? Uh, what uh, differentiates you from the other candidates? Well, actually, that was a question that was asked of me at the town hall debate at the spring meeting in Anaheim last um, spring. And basically, I've served on the board now a couple of terms, quite a few years, and that has only firmed up my resolve to want to help lead the society. We're at a very critical juncture. What is happening in not only our society, the ACS, but the, our country and the world, it's unprecedented some of the challenges that we face. You know, the record unemployment and underemployment of our members is one of my top concerns. And where I've been, um, and where I'm different is that there's a saying that the board should look at everything from the 30, 30,000 foot view. And while I do and can have that overall view, one of the differences I bring is I have a lot of experience also at the grassroots level. I've been a member of ACS for 40 years now, 20 years as a technical scientist, and the last 20 having getting a lot of experience in many of the areas that affect our members. I've been working with career services for 20 years and also with advocacy. And so advocacy, I believe, we can really help to uh, work together with other organizations. The ACS has this wonderful ability to bring leaders and organizations from all, many different sectors. We are all chemists and chemical professionals. We also work with the engineers, of course, and basically, we need to get leaders from academia, government, industry, small business, all working together to attack some of these challenges we face. My, um, one of the advantages I believe I have is the background that I have in many of these areas. I've worked for a large chemical company, a small company of about 100. I've had my own business um, ranging from five to one people, one person. So I have a lot of a diversity of experience and also a multicultural background. I believe that 
plant chemistry is global and we can do a lot to collaborate with our sister societies around the world to advance chemistry and help bring jobs back to America. I think if we work hard with our legislators, both at the state and the federal level, where we have government affair programs, which I have been involved with, both at the state and the federal level, we can work to improve the business climate here. And that's something that ACS is looking at, and I hope to be able to help lead it further to make progress for our members.